Wes with Diamond Contracting here. Um, we're getting ready to cut openings into the wall, install some headers, and put in some new windows. Um, just showing the uh, protection we do here for your carpet and stairs leading into the bedroom where we're actually cutting the hole. And it looks like the guys have got the hole cut. And we'll be installing a window after the new header and framing goes in here. Guys, got everything plasticed off and protected properly. This window has already been cut in headered off and framed in. Before this was just a solid mirror on the back wall. But now they've got some light here in the bathroom. And we'll be doing the finishing touches on here shortly. This customer wanted to add taller garage doors. Um, her existing doors were seven foot tall and we went to an eight foot tall opening. So all three doors we uh, had to raise a foot and uh, put in new headers. Framing looks like it's getting close to wrapping up here. We've got the new carriage style garage doors sitting here. It'll be going in shortly. And let me take you out to the exterior. Got all our materials sitting here. James Hardy fiber cement siding. All tarped off properly. Um, this time of year we begin to get a lot of uh, rain off and on so the pallet tarps aren't sufficient enough so we uh, actually go to an extra step and uh, tarp the top with uh, blue canvas tarps and poly tarps house wrap is up you can see the new headers on the garage doors uh, window opening being cut in there and as we move around to the other side we've got some windows trimmed um, front concrete poured Doing James Hardy fiber cement trim in Arctic White with an Azek um, sub seal. Hardy crown molding on top, water table, and completely flashed over. We cut a new window into the gable up here. The front concrete is poured. <coughs> Uh, we've got proper uh, protection on the corners, um, not only house wrap, but um, aluminum. Double and triple protect your corners here, because we are doing a weaved siding pattern, no trim on the corners. This back wall will be stone, and we'll be building um, columns in the front porch with the gable roof here. Looks like we've got the... Uh, mini upper gable framed in here. This will have some corbels underneath with some uh, hardy shingle. Steel starter strip at the bottom um, to help protect. And we've got the weed corners going up. Smooth siding, Monterey taupe. Eight and a quarter inch with the seven inch reveal. James Hardy Color Plus siding. Sturdy mount. Wall penetration blocks. Quarter inch clearance above them. Very crucial. Here's the new window we saw in the bathroom. And the Hardy straight edge shingles and timber bark went up yesterday. We're doing a nice separation band, belly band board here uh, with the one by two water table on top, completely flashed over, and then uh, we built this louver out of uh, Azek. So what we're trying to achieve here is a completely uh, um, low maintenance exterior application to where this homeowner won't have to worry about anything for 
for decades to come. Hardy fascia, hardy soffit. And it looks like the guys have around here to the backside. Again, Monterey Taupe, smooth, eight and a quarter inch lap siding with Color Plus technology. Doing a weaved corner application, no trim. They've got a nice caulking bead on there now to help protect. Um, and as soon as that dries, we'll touch it up with the uh, Hardy Touch Up kits. Metal corners again, help protect. Windows trimmed out. Love these crown molding details from James Hardy. Uh, I think our uh, side lights are in. Those will be going in the next couple days. We're adding a two foot or 24 inch uh, side light to each side of the door here. And we will be extending this roof about four feet to the right um, to have a roof over this um, new door we'll be putting in here. And then we'll redo the shake shingle on top. Windows are trimmed. And this gable here will have the hardy straight edge shingles also in timber bark. Project is moving right along here in Leewood, Kansas. We are about two and a half weeks into the project. I've uh, been battling uh, rain and unfortunately a little bit of snow also. Um, this time of year is kind of unusual, but we've got a nice separation here um, with coil metal between uh, the brick, which is a cementious product. Uh, we don't want um, the James Hardy product in direct contact with any of that. So we got a nice separation there. And we'll be putting in one window here and one window here. Um, so check back here in a, a week or two and I'll post another video of the progress. A lot of detail on this house. Um, and I'm just, just loving these uh, weaved corners. No trim on the corners. Um, very good application. Wes McIntyre, Diamond Contracting, 913-829-8665. Come find us on the net, diamondcompanies.net. You can also find us on Facebook, Twitter, and Google+. And we should be posting some pictures to Howells here pretty soon. James Hardy, Color Plus Siding Installation, Leewood, Kansas. Diamond Contracting, 913-829-8665.